In this video, I am going to be talking about the latest development on Pakistani Project Azam, and the joining of the Pakistan in Turkish TFX program. Make sure to stay tuned to the whole video, as you will get to know a lot of information from this video. And also don't forget to give your feedback in the comment section after watching the video, whether you agree or disagree with this information, and even I don't mind criticism if it is constructive criticism. So without wasting any more time let's begin the video. A few days ago, the CEO of Turkish Aerospace Industries Temel Kodal, recently in an interview on a Pakistani TV channel revealed that Pakistan and Turkey are jointly working together on fifth-generation aircraft. Temel Kodal also said that the TFX is now officially called Turkish Pakistani Fighter. Some sources also confirm that the Project Azam 5th generation aircraft by PAK Camera and Turkish TFX next generation fighter program is now officially merged, now they will be a single project called Turkish Pakistani Fighter. For this purpose, an agreement has been signed between Pakistan Aeronautical Complex and the Turkish Aerospace Industries. As Pakistan is now the official partner of this project, the aircraft now will be built in Pakistan and Turkey, according to the requirements of both countries. Pakistan will also be sharing all of its progress and experience to Turkey that they have gained through Project Azam. There will also be inputs of Pakistani Air Force's pilots, and the aircraft will be modified accordingly. There's no doubt that this collaboration between Pakistan and Turkey will benefit a lot for developing the next generation aircraft. This collaboration will significantly reduce the timeline of developing the aircraft, and the cost of the project and the aircraft will also be significantly reduced with this collaboration. As we know that Pakistan already has experience in developing the JF-17 Thunder, and on the other hand Turkey has the experience of licensed manufacturing of F-16. In combination these experiences will play a big role in efficiently working on this project or developing the next generation aircraft. Pakistan's good defense ties with China may also play a crucial role in developing this next generation aircraft. According to this development, we can assume that this project will be completed in its given timeline or even earlier than the timeline. That's what I've got for you today. If you liked this video, like it and share it with your friends, press the bell icon to get notified as the new video lands on the channel, and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time, peace out.